In environmental science, one of the key categories or topics is pollution. And within pollution, there's a term called leachate, which is our focus of this video. And we're going to look at what it is, how it forms, and why this is so bad for the environment. This is the Earth Science Classroom. Within pollution, we can look at contaminated sites on the Earth's surface and look at landfill types and different ways to dispose of waste, solid waste, hazardous waste, chemical waste, industrial waste, and they all regard or revolve around different types of landfills. Now, when it rains on a landfill site, the water that's meteoric in origin is going to infiltrate, percolate, and move through the landfill just like it does in soil, which is leaching. Now, leaching is a natural process of transferring nutrients and water to different sub-horizons and layers of the soil. However, leachate is that contaminated liquid waste that's going to flow through any kind of landfill material that's in the ground and then transfer those contaminants, those soluble materials and compounds, both organic and inorganic compounds, heavy metals, with the water to deeper layers and eventually going to flow with groundwater through different rock layers joining with groundwater flow with aquifers being pumped up for drinking water in different areas or even flowing into rivers streams lakes and ponds both through the groundwater system or overland flow so the measure or the amount or degree of leachate severity comes down to the materials that are in the landfill, how much water is going through it, and the ability and the time in which the materials have had to biodegrade or degrade or decompose to release those compounds and mixtures of soluble material and elements that can be picked up and carried and dissolved into the water as it's flowing through the different landfills. So a lot of factors go into the leachate and what, how bad it's going to be if it flows out. However, the general idea is that the leachate should be captured and treated before being allowed to go back into any natural water source, both groundwater or on the surface. So these sanitary landfills or these newer landfills are trying their best to collect as much leachate as possible that is emitted from these landfills and have these sensors and layers and caps and impervious linings to capture any leachate that does exit the landfill site. Thank you so much for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you like it, please subscribe and hit the like button. If you like more on this content, please check out my channel, which has all these videos on earth science.